Well, welcome back everyone. A cold front is marching through the state and it will be moving into our area by tomorrow. It's going to be a dreary day and temperatures will be a little bit cooler. There will be occasional heavy rain as well as we make our way into your Wednesday. Showers will start to taper off. It will be a breezy day and a cool day as we move into your Thursday though. Finally a break from the wet weather and those temperatures will be gradually warming up for the little later part of the week. Highs today was 89 degrees in Hattiesburg. 88 degrees in Laurel. Macomb was around 87 degrees, a record set in Meridian at 91 degrees. So it definitely felt like summer out there and the humidity is on as well with dew points around 73 degrees. It definitely felt steamy out there, but we're going to see a change as we head toward the latter part of this week. Once that cold front starts to move a little bit to the south, notice those winds are shifting to the north in portions of Macomb and even in Baton Rouge, Jackson and Meridian, but we're seeing those south winds in Hattiesburg. That's an indication that the cold front has not passed through quite yet. That cold front will continue to sag a little bit to the south and to the east during the day. Tomorrow you can see numerous showers and thunderstorms all around this front, just providing the focus for many of this activity. So we're seeing some rain and we continue to see rain streaming in from the south heading to the north and we're going to see this activity continue as we head into the latter part of the evening and into the overnight. So take a look at our future radar. Notice there could be some bands of heavy rain moving in as well. All this is coming from the south and it continues to move to the north, streaming in ahead of that cold front. So we're going to see more rain as we start off the day tomorrow. And then around 630, as you can see right there, some heavy rain to our south that will be starting to move into our area. So it's going to be off and on during the day so it's going to be quite a dreary day hopefully you can stay dry definitely grab the raincoat before you head out the door temperature wise it will be quite cool about 10 degrees cooler than today our dew points will drop down into the 60s as well notice those temperatures will be very close to the dew points that means it's saturated and that's where we're going to find the cloud cover the fog and also the showers so we're going to see more rain for tomorrow and possibly also into your Wednesday. Tonight we drop down to around 67 degrees with showers across the area. Tomorrow occasional showers with highs only around 79 degrees in Hattiesburg and roads around 80 degrees Ellisville. We're looking at highs around 77 degrees. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. We drop down to around 72 degrees with the rain ending in the early part of the day on Wednesday, we should see some peaks of sunshine by the afternoon and then pleasant conditions. A break from all the wet weather as we head into your Thursday with the high around 75 degrees. We'll jump to around 81 by your Friday. There should be some sunshine, increasing cloud cover, and then more showers and thunderstorms for this weekend with another cold front. And it's a stronger front that will move in and it's also going to bring drier air. And so those temperatures will start to drop. Overnight lows will be down into the 40s. 69 degrees Ooh. chilly on Sunday Ooh. and then as we start off on Monday look for lows around 41 degrees and our high only around 72 degrees partly sunny skies so it's going to turn pretty cold next yeah. week you definitely Jackets. are going to yeah jacket weather out. for sure lows in the 40s mm -hmm. I mean even the lows in the 50s and 60s are going to want some kind of That's crispy. sweater at least yes, That's right crispy cold yeah <laughs> 48 it's crispy it is. but some of the highs are feeling very nice very nice yes <laughs> thanks <laughs>